Imagine a world teeming with colossal creatures, a world so different from what we know today. This was the late Cretaceous period, a time when dinosaurs were in their prime, a time when they were the undisputed rulers of the Earth. This was a period of incredible diversity with dinosaurs of all shapes and sizes roaming the land. From the towering, long-necked sauropods to the swift and deadly velociraptors, the world was a veritable playground for these prehistoric creatures. The landscape was a lush tapestry of coniferous forests, fern prairies, and flowering plants, a stark contrast to the concrete jungles we are accustomed to. Dinosaurs thrived in these habitats, each species adapting to its environment in unique ways. The carnivores, like the infamous Tyrannosaurus rex, were the apex predators ruling the food chain with their strength and sheer size. Herbivores, on the other hand, found safety in numbers, forming herds that spanned for miles. The seas were no different. Powerful marine reptiles such as the plesiosaurs and the mosasaurs claimed the oceans as their kingdom, while the skies were dominated by the pterosaurs, the first vertebrates to evolve powered flight. In essence, the late Cretaceous period was a testament to the adaptability and resilience of life. Dinosaurs had not only survived but thrived, evolving over millions of years into an array of species that were perfectly tuned to their environments. They were the uncontested rulers of their world, dominating every corner of the planet. For millions of years, they led a reign that seemed unending, a reign that shaped the course of life on our planet. But then, in a blink of an eye, everything changed. The world as these magnificent creatures knew it came crashing down. In what seemed like an instant, the earth shook, the skies darkened, and a cataclysmic event marked the end of an era. But what happened exactly? What could have caused such a sudden and dramatic shift, effectively ending the reign of the dinosaurs? Hold on to your seats, for we are about to delve into one of the most fascinating chapters of our planet's history. Imagine a day like any other, and then, without warning, the sky darkens. In the blink of an eye, the age of the dinosaurs was brought to an abrupt end by an event of cosmic proportions. A rogue asteroid, roughly the size of Mount Everest, hurtled towards the Earth at an estimated speed exceeding 20 times that of a bullet. Its destination? A tranquil spot near the town of Chicxulub, in what is now known as Mexico. As this celestial interloper made its fiery descent, it seared the sky, turning day into night. It was an unstoppable force, a harbinger of a cataclysm that would forever change the course of life on Earth. With a deafening crash and a blinding flash, the asteroid struck. The moment of impact was nothing short of apocalyptic. The asteroid, with all its mass and momentum, punched a hole in the Earth's crust, creating a crater more than 100 miles wide and 12 miles deep. The immediate aftermath was even more catastrophic. The energy released upon impact was equivalent to billions of atomic bombs. This raw, primal force triggered massive earthquakes, tsunamis, and set off a chain of volcanic eruptions. It hurled trillions of tons of debris high into the atmosphere, cloaking the Earth in a shroud of dust and ash. The world was plunged into darkness. Temperatures plummeted as sunlight struggled to pierce through the thick, ashen clouds. A chilling nuclear winter set in, a stark contrast to the lush, warm world the dinosaurs had known. In a matter of moments, the Earth was transformed into a hostile, alien landscape. This was a cataclysmic event of unimaginable proportions. The world the dinosaurs knew was gone. In its place was a new, harsh reality, a reality in which survival was not guaranteed for any life form, no matter how mighty. In mere moments, the world was forever altered. In the first minutes following the impact, chaos reigned. A thunderous crash echoed around the globe, marking the arrival of an asteroid with such force that it forever changed the course of life on Earth. Imagine an explosion so powerful that it created shockwaves rippling through the Earth's crust, reaching far beyond the point of impact. These seismic waves, akin to those triggered by an earthquake, raced through the ground at unimaginable speed. The ground beneath the feet of the mighty dinosaurs shuddered and shook, toppling many and causing sheer panic among these ancient beasts. As if the ground shaking beneath them wasn't enough, the asteroid impact also triggered monstrous tsunamis. The ocean, once a source of life and sustenance, suddenly became a harbinger of death. Giant waves, taller than the largest dinosaurs, crashed onto shores and surged inland, obliterating everything in their path. The water's relentless onslaught left no chance of escape for even the swiftest of creatures. But the devastation didn't stop there. 
The energy released by the asteroid strike was equivalent to billions of atomic bombs. This energy ignited massive fires, turning landscapes into infernos. The sky, usually a canopy of blue or a starlit wonder, was ablaze with fiery fragments from the impact. These firestorms consumed the oxygen, creating a suffocating atmosphere and rained down, setting the prehistoric world alight. The dinosaurs, masters of their world, were suddenly thrust into a nightmarish scenario, the air thick with smoke and ash, the land scorched and barren, the water treacherous and deadly, survival became a cruel game of chance that few would win. The immediate aftermath of the asteroid impact was catastrophic. It wasn't just the dinosaurs who suffered. All creatures, big and small, were subjected to the same harsh reality. The world as they knew it was disintegrating around them, replaced by a landscape of death and destruction. In those first minutes, the fate of the dinosaurs was sealed. The reign of these magnificent beasts was brought to a sudden and brutal end, marking the closing of a chapter in Earth's history. As the dust settled, a new world emerged from the ashes. The landscape was unrecognizable, forever scarred by the celestial intruder that had plummeted from the sky. The asteroid's impact had created more than just a physical crater. It had thrown up an immense cloud of dust and debris that blanketed the Earth. This shroud obscured the sun, plunging our planet into what can only be described as a nuclear winter. Imagine, if you will, a world where the sun's rays are perpetually blocked, a world submerged in darkness. This darkness was not just metaphorical, but literal. Photosynthesis, the life-giving process for all plant life, was severely hampered, leading to a severe decline in vegetation. This, in turn, affected the herbivorous dinosaurs that relied on these plants for sustenance. The ripple effect continued up the food chain, leaving the carnivorous dinosaurs, those mighty beasts at the top of the food chain, starved and weakened. The sudden and drastic change in climate and the scarcity of food led to the extinction of the dinosaurs, a species that had ruled the Earth for over 160 million years. The asteroid impact was a death knell, not only for the dinosaurs but also for approximately three quarters of all species on Earth. The planet's biodiversity took a massive hit, and the once teeming and vibrant Earth was reduced to a desolate and barren land. However, Amidst this devastation, life found a way to continue. Smaller creatures less dependent on large quantities of food and more adaptable to extreme changes in environment began to thrive. These survivors, these pioneers, were the ones who would shape the future of life on Earth. The aftermath of the asteroid impact was indeed a grim period in Earth's history. It was a time of death and decay, a time when the world as we knew it ended. But it was also a time of rebirth, a time when life found a way to adapt, evolve, and ultimately survive. In the end, it wasn't the strongest who survived, but those most adaptable to change. The extinction of the dinosaurs marked the end of an era, but it was only the beginning for the rest of life on Earth. The cataclysm that brought about the end of the dinosaurs was, paradoxically, a beacon of rebirth for the planet. This monumental event, as catastrophic as it was, made way for evolution's next steps. In the aftermath of the dinosaur's extinction, the world was a blank canvas, ready for nature's masterstroke. With the exit of the large, cold-blooded reptiles, smaller, more adaptable creatures began to flourish. The stage was set for the rise of the mammals. The mammals, once living in the shadows of their colossal predecessors, found themselves in a world without apex predators. They thrived in this new environment, diversifying into a wide range of species. From tiny, shrew-like creatures scurrying in the undergrowth to large, majestic beasts that roamed the Earth, the mammals claimed the world as their own. The mammals' evolutionary journey was a slow and steady one, but it was relentless. Over millions of years, they adapted, evolved, and diversified. Among these mammals, one group, the primates, showed remarkable promise. They had an edge over other mammals, a higher intelligence and the ability to manipulate their environment. Fast forward a few more million years and one of these primates evolved into a species that would change the course of life on Earth, humans. We are in a sense children of the dinosaur extinction. Our existence, our civilizations, our accomplishments, all owe a debt to that cataclysmic event millions of years ago. The extinction of the dinosaurs was not the end. It was a new beginning, it was a testament to life's tenacity and its ability to adapt, evolve, and thrive in the face of adversity. So when we look back at the dinosaur's extinction, we see not just a catastrophic end, but a pivotal turning point in the history of life on Earth. 
we see the start of a new era, an era that eventually led to us. From the ashes of extinction, a new world was born, the world we know today.